Oh. And now we've come to another fucking episode in our compendium of cuss words, and this one is unique. Ah, Nicolas Cage. He's often described as one of the craziest actors in Hollywood, but he's probably not given enough credit for what a hard-working actor he is. However, what people might not know is that he's been working hard at finding love almost just as hard as he works in front of the camera. Don't believe us? Earlier this year, the actor walked down the aisle for the fifth time, and we at Rumor Juice couldn't help but wonder who else has been previously known as Mrs. Cage, and why didn't she stay that way? How did a four-day marriage turn into the actor's worst nightmare? Don't forget to subscribe to Rumor Juice. We never let you down when it comes to all the juiciest scoops on all your favorite celebrities. Patricia Arquette, 1995 to 2001. The actor's first wife was actress Patricia Arquette. The two met at a restaurant in 1987, and Nicholas was so struck by her that he asked her to marry her right on the spot. We were just kids. I was 19 and he was like, and you're gonna marry me soon? I was like, no man, we're never even gone on a date. Let's slow it down. Patricia recalled the night they first met. Cage eventually convinced the young actress to go on a date with him, and it seemed to be going well at first. However, they soon split, with Arquette claiming that it was all too much too soon. She was only 19 years old at the time. Eight years later, Arquette picked up the phone and called Cage and said, I'm ready to get married, adding, it was very romantic. Patricia put Nicholas on quite a whirlwind during their time together. She told Andy Cohen that she requested 10 things from Cage as part of a scavenger hunt, including a J.D. Salinger autograph and a black orchid. The idea was we really didn't know each other. And he was like, I met him and Chris, uh, Crispin Glover in a restaurant. And Crispin said, I'm going to marry you. And Nick said, no, I'm going to marry you. And Nick said, give me a list of 10 things, like a quest, and I'll get all these things and then you'll marry me. It shouldn't surprise you that the actor managed to get everything on that list for her. The reasons for their split have remained a bit of a mystery. It was reported that the pair separated nine months after marrying and spent years filing and withdrawing divorce papers before citing irreconcilable differences finally in 2001. Arquette, however, says the rumors of their early separation were untrue. There were times when we weren't living together because we were fighting, but it wasn't as reported, and I didn't feel that I needed to explain that. Though their union reportedly found a mutual and respectful end, Cage admitted in 2018 that he and Arquette hadn't spoken in a long time. Lisa Marie Presley, 2002 to 2004. Before Lisa was married to Nicholas, she took the big plunge with the famous pop star Michael Jackson. They were only married for two years before calling it quits, and then she was swept off her feet by Cage. Unfortunately, their love story was just as short-lived. Cage met Lisa Marie Presley, the daughter of Elvis Presley, at a party in 2000. The two married in August 2002 and filed for divorce 107 days later. Their divorce wasn't finalized until May 2004. In an interview, Cage said there was a sense, a logic to marrying the singer-songwriter given they both came from famous and artistic families. Oftentimes, when you have two people who are very strong in their own personalities and rather intense, sometimes you can have a hard time meshing. We got into this unfortunate pattern of breaking up and getting back together again. He also admitted that he continues to miss Lisa every day, and he wished that they hadn't rushed into the marriage and regretted that they went on to rush into the divorce. However, looking back, he confessed that maybe things might not have changed either way and weren't going to work out. Lisa Marie noted their instant connection was ultimately their downfall. It was one of those things where you're marrying, hoping that you're going to either stabilize it or it's going to, you know, accentuate all that was going on prior to what was problematic. So it kind of did the latter, that's all. Nicholas also touched on his relationship with Lisa Marie, saying that he and Lisa perhaps had too much in common. Two very big personalities that were both too stubborn and not willing to compromise. Alice Kim 2004 to 2016. In 2004, Nicholas and Alice, who is 20 years younger than the actor, might we add, met at a restaurant in LA where the brunette beauty worked as a waitress. They were engaged two months later and married later that same year and soon welcomed their first child, Kalel Coppola Cage. We did it because we loved each other, Cage stated. 
It seemed that Kim brought the best out of Nicholas, and he credited his stable lifestyle to her. In my own life, I have a legitimate level of concern because if you love your kids, you're going to worry, but I hope I'm not like Grug. Do you think I'm like Grug? Uh, not quite, but he's a protective dad. The couple was together for 14 years until Kim suddenly filed for divorce, which broke the actor's heart. He had admitted that he didn't count any of his previous marriages. His relationship with Kim had been the real deal because they had been together for so long and shared a child together. It's no wonder that he was shocked by the file for a divorce. The actor finally thought that he had found his lifelong partner. It was a shocker for me. I definitely didn't see it coming. And those feelings had to go somewhere, so they went into the performance. The actor remained tight-lipped about what led to the couple's split, but said that they have remained on good terms to co-parent their son. Erica Kowicki, 2019. Nicholas's whirlwind romance with Erica, a makeup artist who is 20 years younger than the actor, ended just as quickly as it began. Just four days after marrying in Las Vegas in March 2019, the actor filed for an annulment. The couple had been together for a year before they decided to get married. Unfortunately, everything seemed to go downhill from there. There was a recent breakup. I didn't really want to talk about it, Nicholas confessed. I was pretty upset about that and the way things happened. He also confessed that when he woke up the next morning, he had no idea he was married. In court documents, Cage claims that they were both intoxicated and he lacked understanding of his actions in marrying Koike to the extent that he was incapable of agreeing to the marriage. Perhaps things got a little carried away in Vegas and they had made an impulsive decision to get hitched. Oh, well, let me guess, it's the wrong time. It's the wrong place. I'm wrong again. Wrong about us. Wrong about Thomas Gates! Wrong that you'd like the Queen Anne chair! As it turns out, Cage soon found out that his new wife hadn't been as honest as she should have been when he said I do. However, Erica was allegedly against the idea of the divorce and denied all of Cage's claims that they were intoxicated when they decided to get married. Following the divorce proceedings, Cage's fourth wife then continued to demand spousal support from the actor even though they were only married for four days. Erica explained the need for financial support from Nicholas because his claims against her have ruined her reputation and prevented her from getting work as a makeup artist. Cage also claimed that there were grounds for an annulment since Koiki hadn't bothered to, quote, disclose to Cage the full nature and extent of her relationship with another person. It seems that the claim might mean that she had been seeing someone else when she walked down the aisle in Vegas. The Oscar winner alleged Koiki didn't inform him of her criminal history, including additional active criminal proceedings. However, the document didn't go into details of what the alleged criminal history or active proceedings had been. I think anyone who's even considering divorce and families, that should be required viewing because uh, having been through it, I mean, family law is absolutely the worst. Poor Nicholas. Must have been terrible to wake up the next morning and find out the person you're now married to is someone you don't know at all. Rico Shibata, 2021. Nicholas met 27-year-old Shibata in Japan more than a year ago. The couple was first photographed together in February 2020 while making a visit to Cage's nine-foot pyramid-shaped tomb at a New Orleans cemetery. Cage told his brother that they had spent almost six months apart due to COVID-19. It seems like distance does make the heart grow fonder because Cage made the decision to propose to Rico over FaceTime. I haven't seen her for six months and we were really happy together and we're really excited to spend that time together. And so I finally just said, look, I, you know, I want to marry you. And I, we got engaged on FaceTime and I, I. He admitted, I got her a black diamond engagement ring. Her favorite color is black. So she wanted the black gold and the black diamond. I customized and personalized it, and I actually sent it to her FedEx. Can you imagine how surprised she must have been to open the post one day only to find a new ring in the envelope? We're really happy together, and we're really excited to spend that time together, so I finally just said, look, I want to marry you, the actor shared. Close friends to the actor said in a statement that the pair are very happy after they tied the knot in Las Vegas in February. It was a gorgeous affair followed by a celebration that was even attended by Nicholas's ex-wife, Alice Kim. The date of their wedding holds a special meaning as it honors the birthday of Nicholas's late father. Shibata, who wore a handmade Japanese bridal kimono from Kyoto, walked down the aisle to Winter Song by Kororo, her favorite song. 
Cage, who wore a Tom Ford tuxedo, and Shibata exchanged traditional Catholic and Shinto vows with poetry from Walt Whitman and haiku also included in the ceremony. After the happy news was made public in March, the pair were spotted keeping the romance alive, taking a horse and carriage ride around Central Park. Unfortunately, there's not much known about Rico, other than she's 31 years younger than her new husband and she lives her life out of the spotlight. That will most likely change now that she's married to a famous movie star. Cage fans can only hope that he's finally found happiness and that his heart has been mended after being broken so many times. She might be his fifth wife, but we hope for Nicholas that fifth time is really the charm.